It's me, Courtney Francois. We're doing hair videos. Yay, hair. I mean, I was dying my hair with this natural stuff, supposed to be no chemicals, nothing like that. Some henna powder. So I was like, well, since I'm doing this, I might as well record and make a hair video. Now, I did want to use like some perm rise or some flexi rise, but when I moved, I mean, it was just like random accessories to me at the time. So I just threw it away. It's like I could buy that again. It's only 79 cents. So. We just want to end up doing like a two strand twist. I mean, it's like six, seven o'clock. So this video is obviously going to go into tomorrow when I get off work and I'll take my hair down and y'all can see it. But the henna powder, this is what it looks like in my hair. It's like, it's like mud a little bit. I mean, even when I mixed it up, it was a real muddy consistency. And I only wanted the, the color was a sunset something. Sunset red. I don't know. We'll see. But I guess I just want to add some type of color to just the middle of my hair. So when I have my curls popping, it'll be colorful in this area. Obviously, it's not going to be very colorful. It may just be like a lighter brown. Who knows compared to the rest of my hair. It don't look like it's going to be doing that much. But let's see. Let's see. What I'm using is this Calora Hanna Pop. So it's supposed to condition and thicken. Plants, water, and no chemicals. So it's supposed to be like a red sunset. At the store, they had the color next to it. So, thing is, you're supposed to, you know, wash your hair, towel dry it, you mix the powder, it gets thick, you apply it for like an hour, and then I wash it out my hair. So it's been maybe 30, 45 minutes, but this is what it looks like. To show you the type of consistency I got it too when I put it in my hair. I mean, it was real thick and muddy like when I put it in my hair. It's just soupy. I mean, I'm not gonna add more. I mean, I told y'all I already got some in my hair. But this is how I had it. I had to like mud, soup. So, I wash my, I rinse my hair. I don't use shampoo anymore. I mean, I'm exploring with all types of stuff, so I just use conditioner. Currently, I got this Shea Moisture uh, Coconut Hibiscus Curl and Shine Conditioner. So I use that all through my hair and got it right. And for me to moisturize it before this uh, two strand twist, I'm gonna do. I have this Carol's Daughter Hair Milk. So this is a leave-in moisturizer. I have lavender oil and I have coconut oil. Like I said, I'm experimenting with this whole natural thing and I'm trying to figure out, I'm trying to see what works. I know my hair doesn't absorb a lot. Like I know you do the porosity test and people ask me, do your hair get wet really quick? It doesn't take a long time. And I guess I pay attention, but when I'm in the shower, it takes a long time for it to get wet. I feel like it's just damp, if anything. So, but we rinse this dye out and um, can you, can you see it? I don't. This is not, it's not much going on. Like I could tell it's a tad bit of a tint, but no, there's no, I mean, I, there's no chemical in it, no bleach or anything. So I didn't expect much to happen, but yeah, not much at all. Like I said, this is a little bit of a tint somewhere on the sides. Like you can see the definition, it's a little bit of brown, but not much. So I should have, I should have been doing this while I was talking, huh? Like I said, I'm not gonna, um, I'm not gonna do a whole video, y'all watch me the whole do the whole two strand twist process. We're not gonna do that. No, not at all. But I will let y'all see how I'm gonna get it started. You know what I'm saying? So I put in the Carol's daughter, the leave in moisturizer, the lavender oil, and this is virgin coconut oil. I think I got this like at Walmart I had to look at brands, so I say all oh, these, you know, got it at Walmart. I mean, you can get it wherever. I think it was with the rest of the oils, cooking oils. So, we got it all oiled up. Comb it out. Alright, you know what I'm saying? I mean, some big 
things come in small packages. I think you bought ahead, but it's like, no, no. No, no, it's just shrinkage. There's a whole bunch in there. So, I guess I got to zoom in for y'all. The zoom. So, we're going to get just a nice little piece. I usually do them super big, but I'm not going to do them super big. I have like seven of them. And that'd be it in my head. Seven. So, we're going to do some little. Let's see how that works out for me. Let's go around. I feel like people should know how to do a two strand twist because you're just, you're just twisting, really. But, just in case you don't know. two strands was right there and we're gonna do a whole bunch I so want to shop we'll be back it. when we're done Mama, I want to shower you want to shower yeah all right let's take showers everybody wants showers so we'll be back this is where we are I have for the two strands list that's what we're gonna do we're gonna wrap it up for the night and I guess I'll be back tomorrow in the morning for the video how it out. So I'll check y'all later. Holla! It did not come out the way I wanted it at all. Like, at all. This one, I ended up just doing like a little two strand twist in the hairpin and a little two strand across the hairpin. But uh, yeah, my my two strand twist out is not the way you see on YouTube. They they say it's not supposed to be all fluff fluff at the end and froish. Mine is, you know what I'm saying? So just, we just had to make it do and do. We weren't finna just gonna wash it out or something. We were gonna make these girls do something. We didn't waste all that time and effort for nothing. But point is that the dye did no color. But still, as we see, same thing. Same, no real change in the middle. Our twist style didn't go right. Look, let's see if y'all see the back. Let's zoom y'all around the back. You can see better than I can. But, yeah. So, I mean, we're going to get better at this. We're going to get better at this. I mean, it's a lot of different techniques. We're going to figure out these techniques. But what I did obviously didn't work. So, this was a two-strand twist fail. But it looked all right, though. I mean, we we going to be out here in the world. And it's going to be cute. We're going to take a picture. And they're going to be like, oh, nice picture party. So, we're going to make it work for now. But this isn't what we were going for. As long as everyone knows that this isn't how it's supposed to look. And this isn't what we were going for. But we're going to rock it like we did something right. Okay? Love you guys. Bye.